Hey, welcome back to Character Select. Let's go do the thing. So on that vault, we've got to... Oh. Uh, you know, vault can wait a second. I'm easily distracted. Crap. <laughs> you know what? That was so obvious that it was going to happen. <sighs> this is just one of those games that makes it so delightful to move around. There we go. Wait, was that a different type of yarn? I wasn't reading. Skittle, 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 go, 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 go. Alright, so. See, if I'm quick, I can follow the laser beam the whole way back. Uh oh, I'm in the air. Whoop. Hey, we made it back up. We nearly have enough for uh, the mumble thing, which I really want to find out what that does. <sighs> Look, every time I have to beat these guys up. Thanks, dude. Alright. I'm gonna need to get up top again, aren't I? Alright, up we go. What's the easiest way up? Alright, so there's the gut as we just did a bunch of jumpy stuff off of. Hey, Jack! Eh! <laughs> oh, crap. You know what? I had that coming to me. All told, the game is very forgiving about falling off of stuff. <gasps> Mask guy, what are you doing over here? You got anything cool? Everything I sell is of value. I also sell terrible badges, and yet people buy them anyway. No more bonking against walls while diving. Eh. Beam attack? I want the useless one, but also beams. <sighs> no, nope, we're getting the mumble badge. We're gonna make that terrible decision and we're gonna make it together. Yeah. I didn't, didn't smash and die. Good. Hup. That wasn't so bad. I think. Three. Three. 
Oh, it's about to get mumbly, guys. We're about to get mumbly. Oh, crap! Oh, okay. That wasn't a death plummet, at least. God, this is going to be a terrible... I've wasted a lot of gems just now, haven't I? God, it is making me sit through this mistake. Please, disregard my twitchy behavior. My body has been to places that have left a permanent mark. Oh god. Oh, it's even more awkward than I thought. What's your do? You punch people when big and strong. But Mafia knows that never become big and strong. Mafia heart is broken. What I realize is that I've also made it so that I now have to actually read out everything. It's okay. Well... I was pretty certain I was going to immediately regret that decision anyway, so we just have to, you know, live with it. With my terrible, terrible decision making. Alright, so we need to get back over there. Get the dinosaur hat. Dinosaur hat. Wait, where the heck? Direction did that go? Around? Alright. Is that it was over here, right? There it is. All It's okay, we can make up those gems pretty quickly again. Oh, ow. <laughs> Goodness me, my chair is a squeaky, squeaky thing. Oh well. Yeah, I know I need to go there next. But I like to be sure that all of this is done. Yeah! Oh crap, there's another one. Oh, and we just spent all of our... We just spent all of our gems on the useless bat. Oh, wait, Cooking Cat, what do you sound like? Cooking Cat, what do you sound like? 
Great. <sighs> I regret my decisions. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, so we just really need to very quickly make some more gems. Just fifty more. We can do that, right? Yeah. Fifty more gems. Easy peasy. Yeah, yeah, great. Speedrun star. Maybe slow down. I'm faster than you, but, but faster than you. Ow! Dick! Did you just see that? Okay, that's so silly. Yeah, great. Bye. Hi, hope to see ya. Still the same number of things. We did this one. Alright, awesome. Now let's go to the new area. <laughs> yeah, I'll go there soon. Cheating the race. Okay. You're missing a key item and won't be able to complete this act. Crap. Well, damn. Alright, you are my next one, weren't you? And then, of course, I had all this stuff in here anyway. Ooh, what is this? Painting? <gasps> a rift! And a thing. What the heck? Oh gosh, these paintings are so great. I love that one! They're just like right in the top left. Uh oh. Cookies. This music kind of reminds me of like the Crystal Forest in Final Fantasy. Shit. Okay. So it's out to here. Oh, 
All right, easily enough handled. Okay. Oh goodness, I always get a bit messed up on these. You know, I don't want to hat by mistake. Come on, buddy. <laughs> Who are these fellas over there? Do I gotta jump from them? Okay, that makes sense. Okay, this one's kind of hard. But we did it! So there are enemies that I have to platform by attacking because trying to spring off of them will get me punched. Good to know. Another new color. Ooh, this one's rare. Yeah, more colours. What we got going on for us now? <laughs> I'm liking the colours. Oh, is there a redhead one? I want there to be a cutie redhead one. <gasps> Pink and yellow. Nice. A little bit glaring. It kind of looks like the raincoat instead. And that raincoat is great. Okay, so. Hi, Roomba. Well, I mean, I'll take the three points. A seven-stage tricalculating quantum harmonizer. It's pretty expensive, but who doesn't to treat themselves every now and again? Wow. We have a music room. <gasps> I want to play it. Oh. Ah, yes. The VGS-1, the fastest, most complex supercomputer ever to be built. Boot it up. Yeah, you power it on. A world of computing delight. Greetings, user. Undefined users. Welcome to your home computing experience. Open application. Fun. Internet. Open application. Games. You have to the text-based entertainment application. Uh-oh. Of non-visual fun. Corgi Quest 7, the leashes that bind. You are a corgi. Your name is Alan. You must sever the magical leash holding you to this plane of nastiness. Exits in north, east, and south. You go north. There is a tiger. Talk to Tiger. Your attempts do not swear the Tiger. The conflict he has seen at the pause of your kind has given him such strength that the weight of your words is negligible. He mauls you very badly. Try again? Yeah, okay, fine. North. Bark at him. You bark. It's loud and good. He's unduly startled. Um, I mauls you really quiet. Damn it. Yeah, try again. You cannot actually go east. You've been tricked. Crap. South. You go south. There's a set of gates. They're guarded by a prismatic wolf. Bark. You bark. It's really quite sonorous. The prismatic wolf rapidly shifts between spectrums, visible and invisible. You're a dog, so you really only see two colours regardless. So whatever, I guess. It flees in the gates and now I got it. It would probably come back for your left, though. Go south. You go through the gates and arrive at a grassy clearing. There's a large canyon here. Exits north and south. Jump! You try and jump the canyon. It's possible you didn't know how big canyons are. Maybe you weren't or maybe that wasn't appropriately described. It was very large and really deep. You possess the immense means to do so. Try again? Alright. We got this. Okay. Bark at the wolf. South. North? There is a set of big gates. Who are you quest began? Crap, okay. So, bark at him. South. And then south again. You pass a small field, arrive at a camp of wandering blacksmith. The larger field introduces himself as Barry. I guess it's a field. There is a smaller field behind you, a similar larger one in a likely non-threatening manner. Alright, talk to Barry. You talk to Barry. I may have mentioned this earlier, but it's a stretch to describe the noise you make as talking. He offers to make your weapon and promptly does so. It's a sword for dogs. You have a dog sword now. Oh my god, I've got a dog sword. Bark. And north again. And north again. Bark. Damn it! 
No, fine, I give up. Internet. Search. You selected search. Uh, oh, God, no. Alright. Zero results for, for fun. Your search is just submit for federal review. Fine. It's a bookcase, also known as a cool word zone or a thing you can't even slightly fool yourself. Stephen, you'll never find a publisher, and all that time you spend on your study is time you could spend with your kids. Depending on where you're from. <laughs> I just <laughs> just bumbled into that sentence. Oh god. Okay. I love this place. I love this place. We have so many gears. Ooh, sit. <sighs> oh, I need a moment. <sighs> okay, moment's over. Oh, that is actually a mirror. It's a very clean mirror. Just wait a second. Oh, no, it's a window. Okay. This is your bleeding edge top-of-the-line audio device. Without it, you wouldn't be able to change your favorite radio broadcast like acquaintances at the table, goodbye from Sunshine Town, or two brothers, and then also a third additional brother, myself. Fuck, I love whoever wrote this. They are fucking- they're just a madman, and I love them. Yeah, I know, the time rifts, no problem. Where is it, just so we know? Wherever that is. I should probably shouldn't even bother looking. Okay. Dead Bird Studio. Find out where those timepieces went. Two and a half stars. Actors all terrible. Legal status. Totally not allowed in. Sweet. Ah! That's great! Oh my gosh. And Jazz. We get Jazz. And then Bucky. <gasps> we need to make friends with the puppy. Bobby! Oh yeah, shit. <laughs> ah, I left the mumble badge on. Ah, crap. Your moon penguin just gonna write some loud noise dribble. Wanted a peck next to dance around while a bird seed I'd visit my grandchildren. Nonsense, darling, nonsense. Oh my gosh, you just split. Look at you go. You Alex Press birds are gonna record another boring train related western. You've done so the last ten years, darling. What? No, we haven't, you buffoon. Conductor, darling, this year will be winning the annual Bird Movie Award, as our new movie props will bring in the audiences. These shiny things from. <gasps> no! Those are mine! No! Those are mine! Oh no, darling Clay, you only took inspiration from my flash new props. And Dozzy, get out of here, I've got a movie to record. Fine by me, but we're the ones who win the annual Bird Movie Award, mark my word. Those sons of bitches. Come back with my out. Oh. Oh, crap. Oh yeah, let's see how well you do when you can't get into reception. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh wait, she's on the picnics inside the studio for some work harder. Alright, time to go out, so let's go make our killer movie. I'm receptionist, can you please close off that vent? I don't want the smell of penguin to kill anyone in my crew. Son of a bitch. Alright. I wanted to ask this reception guy a question, but he hasn't acknowledged me at all. Uh, but... Now I've been standing here for so long, it'd be awkward to start up a conversation. Ugh, my condolences, buddy. I have to break it to you. I really suck at interacting with other birds. You know what? I don't have to break it to you. You're aware. Oh, hey, little chirper. They're recording right now, so no one's allowed in. We're only insured for bird staff. Letting you in would be a liability. Don't even think about sneaking inside. Jontron? Is that you? Huh? 
Oh, fucking Jontron? You, are you a bird? Sorry, I'm just a little bit in shock. You want that movie prop they carried in? Are you the kind of person that sells movie props on eBird? No. Uh, hi there. I'm an express owl. Which really just means I ride the Owl Express that the conductor... I need to ride the train to get to work. But the conductor makes unexpected stops all the time. I have no idea why we're at a movie studio. I need to be at work in 15 minutes. That's unfortunate for you. ...feed between the conductor and DJ Grooves. Like, why does a train operator and a disco guy want to compete? We're all birds here. Right? You know what, you're right. I guess cooperating is kind of stupid. I guess. Yeah. Just ignore... Okay, sure. Hey, what's up? Please disregard my twitchy behavior. Yeah, I remember that. You die in one hit only for the no. Upgrades your hat to a scooter. Ah, oh, I want that. A scooter badge. I also want deadly laser beams. Seven thousand gems. Would you like a mumble badge? I can pay with a mumble badge. I I got mumble badges. Hey, little girl! You should join our DJ Groove's fan club. You get a membership card and everything. Yeah, sure, whatever. Now, what brings you to Dead Bird Studio? Yeah, great. Watch where you're go DJ Grooves means a lot to us, so yeah, okay. Oh Don't god. Anyone this? But before DJ Grooves be Who would have thought he would run a night like this guy? Ooh, glasses. Young lady, if I catch you in the studio, you'll receive a ticket so Um Yeah, about that. Uh yeah, sorry. I have no idea. Hmm. Okay. Alright, so if you get caught, you get in trouble. Oh shit! Oh crap. Oh my god. Um, I'm quite in debt. Oh, 200,000 gems in the hole. Don't worry, we found two. Maybe they'll like a mumble badge. Shit, ow. Okay, so that's... Assault on a cactus? Nice. I'm not harassing anybody! No, not back here. God damn it. What do you mean, Alhara? 
harassment. I ain't harassed any owls. I am in debt, guys. Okay. I'm hiding. Can't see me. This is such an inventive mission, okay? I just want to put it out there that this so far has been pretty impressive. Like, all the ways that this is different from expected... Oh god. Yeah, like, this has been so different from anything I've come to expect from, um, like, platformy stuff. This really, really weirdly managed stealth mechanic. I can't wait to see what comes of this flippin' strange owing lots of money thing. Oh, crap. Okay. Uh, up here, is this going to turn into a boss fight or what? Oh, dude, stunning! This trophy is everything I desire on the shelf in my living room. Of course, this big trophy is just a plastic replica. The actual trophy is really. You don't say. You know what? More about your tiny little trophy on the next character select. <laughs> 